everyone, my name is Jess Gagin. I'm the current Miss Lancashire and a Master's student of Aerospace Engineering. And today, we're gonna to be talking about rocket science. Now, if you've met me before, you will know that I am super passionate about showcasing science, technology, engineering, and maths to kids, because these are four core subjects which truly are everywhere that we look. And today, I'm gonna to demonstrate that by use of a catalyst. Now, when we launch a rocket, we have two main fuels, liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen. And we also add a catalyst into that mixture to speed up the rate of a reaction. And we actually have catalysts all around us every day. We in fact have catalysts in our bodies. Our biological catalysts are called enzymes and they help with all sorts of different processes right the way through us, including breaking down food in your stomach. Now, you're probably wondering what is in front of me. In my beaker, I have a solution of hydrogen peroxide, I have some dish soap, and I have some food colouring. And right now, there is actually a reaction taking place in that beaker. The hydrogen peroxide naturally wants to break down into water and oxygen gas, but it's taking its time, and this can take a really, really long time. So we can speed this up by use of a catalyst. And my catalyst in today's experiment is potassium iodide. Now, if I add the potassium iodide to the hydrogen peroxide solution really quickly, we have a crazy reaction where we've got all this oxygen gas being produced rapidly and it gets caught in the soap forming all of this foam. And that is an example of a catalyst. This is the catalytic decomposition of hydrogen peroxide to form oxygen gas. My name is Jess Gajan and my talent is showcasing science, technology, engineering and maths to kids.